Piper so I set up Papa John's set up my feet there to the siren head. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's perfect, is it? Alright, Max, I'm gonna send you the picture. <coughs> terrible. My phone is so slow. <sighs> Alright, thank you, Vincent. Vincent needs to make his voice come too. Turn it down, Zach. Never. You're destroying the stream. We also need Connor. You need to do the same thing. We need you to be like. We already said this. No, we'll do, we can do that later. For this, but for right now, should we just like? Restart yeah, this whole I'm still thing. here. I'm just finishing up something. Restart what? This entire stream. Why? Sorry, I'll be any second con. I don't know. Just, just hurry it up. Hurry it up. Hurry what up? The stream, bro. Wait, I'm trying to find out how to put a stupid thumbnail on. Until then, we're just going to sit here and wait. He sent me the picture of uh, this, this photoshopped Mr. Beast. <sighs> yeah. Don't worry, folks. We'll get. Okay, we got we'll the thumbnail. Situated soon. Uh, what was that? Okay. Right. Uh. So. Do it up. Oh, I can do this better. Mine's better. It's more scary. Is it the uh, Max? I'm not seeing the thumbnail. You have to reset, reset, reset. I reset it. Reset it again. I reset it as many times as I can, man. I don't see it, bro. It should be there. Alright, we're gonna look again. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. There we go. It's so weird because it's like not showing the thumbnail, it's just like it's only showing the thumbnail in my inbox. Uh, Alright, is it live? Yep. Alright, folks. Uh, Papa John's was set up by Pete Davidson and Siren Head. Alright. Now, this is a deep conspiracy. <laughs> Not even a conspiracy. <laughs> this is, this is, this is. No, no, no. <laughs> That's... I can't. <laughs> what am I looking at? <laughs> what do you mean? What's <laughs> <funny? laughs> Oh, my... <God. coughs> Lordy. Lordy. <laughs> anyway... Um, <sighs> all right, folks. Uh, I guess we're gonna start it again. This is this is about. Oh, actually, let's let's rewind to last night talking about Morgs mob and how Morgs isn't real. Okay, Alon, you want to tell us about what happened in England? Give me a second here. Uh, this is a very serious. I must close my door. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, this is how it went down. Uh, so I, I landed in London, right? Morris was nice enough to give me a uh, ride to his house, and we discussed a bit and. He gave me, he gave me about fifty-five thousand dollars, right? 
Wait, so nah, were you talking you. to Morgs or his mom? Uh, his mom was not there. But it, Morgs was. It smelled was. really bad in his house. <laughs> but Morgs isn't real, so who are you talking to? That wasn't... Doesn't Morgs have a really gray beard? <laughs> no. <laughs> who the fuck did I talk to? Him? <laughs> I, I'm sorry, folks, for not laughing. This is just a serious matter. I I don't know a lot. Who were you talking to? I'll, I don't know. I, Did they say any information about themselves? No, they just here's the money. I'm like, thank you. There you go. That's it. Yeah. I mean, I'm like, are you Morris? And they're like, yeah. I'm very deep voice. I'm like, okay. Yeah. Like, do the pressure to the voice. I was like, are you Morris? Like, yeah. That's me. Yeah, right. okay. Wow. Well. Yeah. Do we have? I'm confused. Who could have been? It might have been the dad. The dad. Unless it was the Unibomber. Unless it was the Unibomber. Again, folks. The Unibomber is Morgan's mom. <laughs> um, we'll see. I got the. We just got eight. <laughs> <laughs> what did you get now? I'm freaking. We have a. <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. I'm not laughing. This is very innocent. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Max, <clears throat> you just got another breaking photo. Yeah. Folks. Um, later tonight, around 8 p.m. or so, we are doing, we are discussing why Mr. Beast's face is so large. Okay. No, Max, please look at the new photo that Alon, okay. Alon's our guy, he's for all of our information. He just got a new photo, this is an official photo. Let's see this one. <laughs> okay. This is a beast. It's frightening, right? <sighs> it's terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> we really anyway. need to be safe for Mr. Beast. Yeah, yeah. so is that, the, is that the picture we're gonna have to use? Yeah. Uh, or do you wanna use yellow? Uh, I think yours is a lot better. But yeah, this is just, uh, alright, so let's get straight to it. We all know that Papa John's is innocent here. Now. Did he say the N-word? Yes. What was he forced to? Also yes. Pete Davidson is a scrawny douchebag, alright? That should have his head stomped on on the sidewalk repeatedly. Over and over and over. Now, does a lot of my aggression come towards the fact that many girls, like models on Instagram, find him very hot? The fact that I look like nothing like him piss me off, and it's like, you find that thing hot? Like, usually I'm not mad. I'm like, power to you, bud. These hot women are finding you hot. Alright, but this time it ain't the case, because he, he's just some other animal here, and I don't like him. So, the yeah, um, it, it, so, yeah, I don't, so, besides how much of a terrible thing he is, he's also corrupt. Now, you're probably asking, why, why would Pete Davidson, now, we'll work Siren head back into this. He's a huge figure. But why would, we're starting off with Pete Davidson. Why would Pete Davidson want to shut down Papa John's Pizza? I'll tell you why. 
<clears throat> Ever seen? All right. Yep. A little Caesar's Pizza commercials, right? Wait, hold up. I think someone's typing, but it's not showing. <laughs> we have a message. Okay. Javian GG says, "Yo, can I have mods?" Yes, you can, sir. You can have mods if you stay loyal to the stream. Yeah, if you stay loyal to the stream. Now, this our our entire cause is a stretch. All right, this is this is truth. There's no jokes, no myths, no nothing. We don't laugh here. We just expose the truth. And the truth is, is that Pete Davidson and Siren had set up Papa John's. Last night we were talking about Morgs, how Morgs is not real. He's employed by VAT19.com to sell more dildos and pup plugs to people. And that Morgs mom is an evil creature with a huge schlong that pees out baby eyeballs because it melts. Now her acid in the womb, in the uterus, leaks, her stomach acid leaks into the uterus. Melts the babies, only leaves the eyeball. That's what she pees off the eyeball. I am loyal, it's me, Jay. Is it? Wait, what? He said it's Jay. I don't know who Jay is, bro. It's not the guy from last night. No, it's not. The one who's coming to your stream every day. This is a new. Oh. We, we're, we have new content. Okay, you have to stay loyal to this content. Yeah, yeah. We got, this is a new content, we're just overviewing what happened yesterday, which was the whole point of the situation. That's not important. The point is that Pete Davidson and Cyrus had set up Papa John to force him to say the N-word on a, on the conference call. That got him fired and taken down from his own position. Now, here's the thing, alright? They probably wonder what was Pete Davidson while Papa John's pizza. He's getting laid a lot. You know, he's an actor. He doesn't need pizza. That would be true. If, but, if you were a simpleton. But since you clicked on this stream, you're clearly not. Right? And none of us are. So. <laughs> Is that all you want, Javian? You want what? you want mod? Just give him mod. He's only here for mod. He's not here for the story though. You gotta you gotta make a decision, Javi. We'll we'll give you we'll give you mod, but you gotta stay loyal to this and you gotta spread it around. You gotta spread this. You have to spread this stream around because this is an important stream for society right now. Society needs us. I am kid. Okay. What? He said he is kid. Like, you're, are you a child? What you're saying? That's what he's saying. No, just ask him. Uh, you know, I just ask him. So just... He's here for the story. He says. It ain't a story. It's just the truth. It's a piece. It's a piece, a like piece of art. A p not art. But there's no story, so what? Wait, we're talking. We're. He said, but there's no story, so. We're, we're talking. There's no story. You're right. There is no story. Only truth. Um, but we're talking about it right now. Here's why Pete Davidson would want. We're gonna get to both. We're gonna get to all sides. I don't know, didn't mean to set up here. Hold on, I'm at Max. Oh, Ari is our information guy, he gives us all this information. Now, I'm gonna play this audio system. Now, listen to this. Pete Davidson has good correlation with Little Caesars. As we know, Pete Davidson's a total scumbag, okay? Now. Can I have mods? Okay, bud. Now, Pete Davidson. Alright. Mm -hmm. We all know. That he was a big part in the Little Caesars bombing. Come on, you want to play audio for the Little Caesars bombing before the bombs went off?
Did you hear that? Nah, that's Pete Davidson being racist. <laughs> oh, Javian was timed out by Lau. Lau, can you please explain? <laughs> yeah, Lau. I think Lau understands the truth that he's only here for the mod. Whoa. I mean, I'd have to trust Lau, though. I know. Like, he didn't even say anything. He just... He just made an executive decision for us. A beautiful executive decision. He was spamming. Was he? He was. Oh. Um, uh, anyway. YouTube. Oh, YouTube. Yep. Yeah, Twitch but. won't allow us because they're too deep. They're, they're not oriented on the truth like we spread. Yeah, we got banned off of Twitch. Yeah, for this content. And you know what the... You want me to read their email? Right now? Yeah, read the All email. Right, I'm to read the email that they <clears throat> gave me right now. Okay. Here's my email that I got. Tis the season for pleasure. Christmas comes early this year. Get a lifetime of Playboy Plus. That is not the right... <laughs> That's that's not the right email. Um, <laughs> here it is. Okay. Hi, this is Twitch. We banned you because we don't like people telling the truth. LOL. Exclamation point. LOL. Exclamation point. And then it's just a fat black nude lady. All right. What? Twitch? Yeah, Twitch emailed me that. Terrible. They're a terrible. Terrible. They're terrible Nazis. company. Terrible yeah. company, terrible serious service, terrible, they're Nazis, alright? <laughs> anyway, back to Pete Davidson, bombing Little Caesar's pizza. Okay, Allah, can you please play the audio of the... Now, Pete Davidson went to a low income... Before you play it, before you play it, Pete Davidson went to a low income community and started a Little Caesar's pizza pepperoni party. That's what he called it. Bunch of people showed up. Everyone was dancing, having a good time. Our music was playing, okay? And yep. here's what Pete Davidson did. Alright, Alon, this is official audio. Alon, please play the audio. Yes. That's enough of the audio. Alright. You see? That's the sound of innocent people screaming because they exploded the floor. Okay. Now, Pete Davidson also went to Pizza Hut one time and raped his then girlfriend, Ariana Grande. Not raped, I mean, uh, like, rapped with her. It's talking about how bad the pizza stunk, okay? Causing an EMT to crash straight through the doors, alright? And kill everyone inside. See, this is a trend of pizza patterns. But now you're probably like, why Papa John's pizza? Okay. A pizza company, okay? And that with an owner. And a well documented sexual relationship between Pete Davidson and the owner, Papa John's son Poe. Uh, not making that up, by the way. I'm not making up any of this, but the son's actual name is Poe. But why would they do that? Max, want to take over here? Why would they do that? What, what Why would Pete on? Davidson want to slander and destroy? We're gonna get into everyone's motives and then how they did it and everything. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> so Pete Davidson, right? Terrible man. Only uh, wants what's best for himself. Okay. Exactly. We're talking about why he set up Papa John's. So okay. In his opinion, he thinks Papa John's is a terrible business that is only in it for the money. But actually, we had an interview with Papa John's. 
And we found out. Yeah, listen to what he said. He's more broke than like anybody. He gives away like all his money. Yeah, he's he's in it because it's a family business. Exactly. Now, Max, please talk about Poe and Pete Davidson's sexual relationship. Poe being Papa John's son. Okay, so Poe is a rebel. Okay. Total he, rebel. He hates. He hates his dad, Papa John's. Okay, and when he found out that Pete Davidson has a, had an interest for him, he decided to take it as an opportunity to destroy his dad's business. Okay. Oh, yeah. Along. Do you have some official information on the sexual acts that they reported each other? Dude, what was that? Do, do you have any information on the sexual acts that Pete Davidson and Poe did? Yes, let's see here. It did a lot of penis things, he says. Right? What, what kind of things were that? Dare I even <laughs> say it in this chat? You must. For the truth. Folks, we're not in it for the viewership, we're in it for spreading the truth. So I guess yeah. technically we're in it for the viewership, yeah. but if we get banned, if we get banned, it don't matter. We'll come back stronger from the truth. So, Alon, please go ahead and talk to the people about sexual acts. They run it. And trust me, this is not a breach of privacy. This is just, this is just, this will lead into something. <laughs> Rob Uyana says, you guys are right. Papa was set up. Papa was set up. Yes. That's what we're trying to say here. We're trying to but expose the truth. By Pete Davidson and Siren Head, specifically. Alright. Now, Alon, please go on about the sexual acts that Papa John's son Poe and Pete Davidson did together. Yes, they, uh, done anal. Anal, of course. A lot of yeah. diarrhea. Listen. What? Okay. The bed sheets were covered. And it's just disgusting what they've done. And really, I think you're gonna go to hell for it. If any hole like in the body, you know, they, they touched, you know, and they used. And that's as much detail as I can go. All we're gonna say is that Poe's now blind. Okay. That's correct. Now, <coughs> it's a well known fact. That back in the 80s, Papa John himself said, God, I'd really hate it if, so like, they're asked, Do you have any fears for your new starting, like, huge company? Papa John responded with, In the interview, he said these exact words. Okay. <clears throat> he said, um, He said these exact words, alright? God, I'd really hate it. They're like, do you have any new fears about your company? And he's like, yeah. I'd really hate it if somebody that wanted to, like, shut me down has sex with my son and made him blind. And what did Pete Davidson do? Oh, oh wait, Mark listen here, Davidson. listen here. Rob, oh, you know, has a question. Alright, Rob, uh, let's, let's see. What is this question? Do you guys think Papa's Day of Reckoning has to do with Pete Davidson? Please answer. 100% now will he Absolutely. will he mention Pete Davidson we can't say but we can say his day of reckoning will come it will come soon we have to stay tuned alright and it, 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 it's gonna lead into this what was said what happened who the cons like the like listen we're just setting because since he can't say it out of threat of being assassinated we're here to stay we're here to spread the truth about who is truly the mastermind behind it which is pete davidson and siren Ed, okay now if you're wondering well if you why are you guys not afraid of being assassinated because we're not only willing to die for our cause which our cause is spreading the truth all right we know one of our good hosts of the show is married to frank ocean <clears throat> yes this is know, true 
as we all know, Frank Ocean is not only a very reliable source, but Frank Ocean can control the ocean. All right. Yeah, so he he's lives on the beach. Big. Yeah, he's a very powerful figure, and if we ever need anything, we just call him up and be like, be like, yo, <clears throat> send a tidal wave to these people. They're going to kill us. He's like, okay. Oh, wait, listen to you. Rob Yuna says, I have a good time watching you. I subscribe. Oh, oh, thank that you. That is appreciated, <laughs> Rob. Not only is it appreciated, but it's a smart move to make. It is. Okay. Because you're here for the truth. You're here for the truth. And I think that's something that we all forgot about. Um, so, <clears throat> um, we will have a stream later tonight. Eight, around 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is just a stream before that, but th that stream tonight is going to be why, why Mr. Beast's face is so just round and scary. Yeah, like why does he have an ugly shaved face? Yeah, and Rob, we have a we have another question. Uh, I have a question. What did you what did you look up to find this? Yeah, what did you search in YouTube to find our stream? Hey, how many viewers do we have right now? We were at like six before, but then it went down to three. Oh, it don't matter. We got like good people like like Rob. Rob is all, it makes it all worth it. Rob and Lal. Rob and Lal. Lal Rob did a great job is, moderating before. Lal is an amazing person. They rob a moderator too. He, he needs to be one. Rob? Yeah, Rob needs to be a moderator. Too. Okay, Rob, you, you can have mod. We, we need more people. Use like it. For our cause. Use it carefully. Use it carefully. <sighs> but it's a big bag of honor, badge of honor to have. It is. Now, <clears throat> again, around 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Papa is John's conspiracy, conspiracy is not. Oh, that's what you looked up. <laughs> Wait, what? He looked up Papa John's conspiracy. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> we need people like you, Rob. We need people like because you, you are actively just searching for the truth. Exactly like Lao. Like commenting die on Morgz's video. Yeah, Lao was a guy from last night. Our video last night was about how Morgz <clears> is <throat> not real. Yeah. He's actually employed for Bat-19 to sell more pills and bucks and bucks. Okay. Now, Morgz's mom is a horrific creature with a huge schlong and uh, peased out baby eyeballs. Okay. But if you want to watch that, <clears throat> she was about like an hour and 40 minutes long. Um, yeah, you can find it here, you know. But... Uh, okay, Vincent, do you want to be part of the stream? Please. Please. Yeah, alright, Max, walk him through the so he can be heard. <clears throat> Pete Davidson, no good, yes, you are correct. You're 100% correct, he's a scumbag and needs to have a, a, a cinder block bashed on his head until he, he can't see. Yeah. But. That's besides the point right now. But back to what you <laughs> said before, hold up. This is not even a conspiracy theory. This is yeah, the yeah, truth. Yeah. This is just the truth. We don't, we don't do conspiracy theories. These are all official pieces. We've done a lot of research. We have a lot of official documentation and audio. We have so many things. Uh, this ain't conspiracy. This is just truth serious. Uh, maybe catch my truth. Now, Max. <clears throat> okay, so first, Vincent, you need to turn your microphone volume down a little bit. Yeah, okay. Is it done? Yeah, that's a lot better. And now you have to go to party settings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, speak. Alright. There we go. Now you're in the stream. 
Alright, now folks, this is Frank Ocean's lovely husband. Yes. Actually, fiance. Fiance, they're not, they're not together together yet. Yeah, take a he, while. he doesn't proposed. love him for his money, he loves him for yeah, himself, they, they his personality. His music. Now, they do make love to his music, but they truly love each other. And we've known Vincent for such a long time. And yeah, Vincent, how's Frank Ocean? How's Frank doing? No. But, uh, uh, he's doing pretty good. Pretty good what, right what, is he, what is he doing? Well, <laughs> right now he's uh he's been working on his power with the ocean. He sunk a cruise liner the other day. <laughs> oh. And uh, we indulged on the crab legs. And it was it was uh, honestly fun he, fun get out. He indulged on his crab legs. Okay, can we have an idea? Can we? Do you have an estimate of what his next album will be out? Um, very shortly, I can tell you that. In order oh, to God, meet you, he says. Wait, you know, what? He, Rob said it's an honor to meet you, Frank Ocean's husband. It's an honor, honor to meet who? Vincent. Oh, Frank Ocean. You know what I'm <laughs> it is. Vincent's a great guy. I've known him for a long time. Thank um, you, Rob. You deserve that moderator spot. Exactly. Yeah, wow, wow. And. Um, the guys you want here. A true honor indeed, says Lau. Yeah, no, no problem. It's an honor having you two aboard. It's an honor having you guys aboard. But <laughs> yeah, but um, it said how big is Frank Ocean's penis? Um, I should have like a foot and a half. <laughs> <laughs> how do you how do you deal with that? Um, a lot of Tylenol. Okay. Uh, thank you. Thank you for opening up. Good. Yeah. Now, can, can you poop normally at this point, or do you just have to like pray that you don't shoot yourself constantly? Um, well, cause he's one with the ocean. I just have like pay a bunch of eels to hold it closed. Oh. <clears throat> I'm so Does giddy he right now. Ooh, is that? Rob. Good, Rob. Our family donkey is so happy. Well, who said that, Rob? Rob. Now, Rob, Rob sounds like an amazing person. Rob, do we, our family donkey didn't do it hard? <laughs> like all of us have to do it. Or your family. I mean, we'd, we'd consider Rob and Lau, you guys are definitely part of our family. But, um, we, um, like, do you actually own a donkey, or are you saying- like, My family, we has a donkey. Oh. Uh, That's interesting. It is interesting, how's it doing? As we wait for that answer. Which, does Frank have any unreleased songs that he just sings to you, especially? Uh, no. He doesn't like to talk about work too much. He likes uh, to spend a lot of time with me and, uh, and the other sea creatures. That's beautiful. You have kids together? Uh, well, biologically we can't, so, uh, <coughs> we've just been, like, adopting, like, those little Cuban children that get lost on their way to Florida. Oh. <laughs> okay, so listen here. <laughs> Rob comes from India, and Lal comes from Mars. Mars? <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. What? It is. I had one. Wow. Oh, never mind. Wait, what? I thought I had one kill in that game. Now, let's get back to. <laughs> now, Vincent, what is Frank's opinion <clears throat> on. What is Frank's opinion? Okay. Um, Pete Davidson. Well, no, no. How about how about this? What is his opinion on Papa John's first? Well, Frank Ocean used to do some of the Papa John's like music, so oh, obviously he felt very upset. Yeah, like some of the music for the commercials, and he used to okay. him and Papa John were good friends. He used to go to, like clubs together and like sing, and uh, okay. so when Papa John's was taken out, so was. 
Frank Ocean. Okay. So now Frank is out of a job. I mean, he has millions off of his music career. Yeah. Yeah, but he lost so, a good friend in the process. Yeah, he lost a good friend in the process, too. That's very sad. And he despises Pete because of it. Uh, what, how does he feel about Siren Head, though? <laughs> which we will get into soon. Siren Head? Yeah. Um, I haven't really asked him. Can you ask him? Alright. Pete, what do you think about Siren Head? <laughs> Pete. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Frank. Frank, what do you think? Pete is this little dolphin. I'm asking him to send a message. Oh, Pete, go ask oh, Frank to send What a coincidence. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big coincidence. <laughs> his name is Pete Ocean. <laughs> go, ask, go ask Frank to ask his opinion on Iron Man. Uh. He doesn't really have an opinion, he just says he's a very creepy guy. That's about right. But anyway. And very loud too. <laughs> where do we leave off here? Yeah, he is loud. But where Sorry, I won't off? be able to stay as long as I did last stream. It's Who's okay, loud. Loud? but will you be here for the Mr. Beast stream? Yeah, we, oh, Mr. Beast stream again is going to be around 8 p.m. Eastern Standard oh, Time. Yeah. We're gonna be playing Uno, like you requested. Oh wait, I'll be back. Someone's <laughs> calling me. <clears throat> All right. Oh, Max is gone. Hold on, can you give us some insight? Um. Wait, no. You know what? We'll get we'll get you here soon. But let's talk about why. Okay, never mind. Um, I, got I'm, the... I have all the info for Mister Beast. So. Yeah. All right, I, I know you have you have the info for everything. Most of By the way, so you're anyway. Um, yeah, Pete Davidson's a total scumbag, like, and here's the thing: that happened, all right, when he was dating Ariana Grande, all right, you'll be on the Uno stream too, Rob. Okay, yeah, that's, that's gonna, gonna be the the Mr. B stream is gonna be on Uno. Yeah, we're gonna be playing Uno. Wow, they're killing Mr. Beastie. But, um. <laughs> um. But. Pete Davidson? When he was dating and was with Ariana Grande, he took her to Pizza Heaven. A lot. <clears throat> and told her to stuff her scrawny little face. And he tried to make her fat. Now, eventually, that's what led them to break up. <clears throat> but. You know. Whatever. We don't really care about her. She's a bitch. But. To be like Papa, uh, I also eat 20 pizzas in 30 days. Rob Actually, it was. 40 pizzas, 30 days, in 30 days. Not to be mean, I was just correcting, because you need to understand that that pizza just don't have the same taste. That's by Pete and Siren Head's design. Now, Siren Head is actually, it's more like Pete. Pete, we're about done with, all right? Main motives was just to get John out of the, out of the place, because he's just an evil person in general. Um, I remember one time I was at a Hollywood party. I'm pretty, I'm pretty famous myself. I'm in with the clique with everyone, pretty much. So they just always invite me to Hollywood parties or the Oscars and shit, right? Actually, all of us are. I remember one party we went to. It was like an SNL party. Um, Pete uh, saw this little Jewish kid. It was like, hey, you hey, came. Why, why are you even? Wait, what? This is horrible. And I he said, hey, you little K-word. The kid was, like, crying. He was like, me? He's like, yeah, Pete. And the people like, watch this. And he snaps his mom's neck. <laughs> we're not laughing, like, guys. We're crying. Yeah, we're not. such a terrible... No, he, yeah, he's not, <laughs> he's not laughing. He's crying. Yeah. He's so um, sad. It's a witness, witness this, too. But, and then he ripped off the little boy's... Dick and balls, ate it, 
and he took his testicles and shoved it up his nose and was like eating a wiener and he's like ready blew it up like a balloon and made a stuffed animal out of it and the kid was just on the ground of pain and Pete unhinged his jaws and like swallowed the kid whole and then like ran away with just a giant like thing in his stomach and he just sprinted away and I don't know how to feel about it but all I know is that that was a terrible act that gives you this happens like at every party he goes to man. Yeah, like, he's almost like he's crazy. He's nuts. Just a bad person. Wait, did oh, Rob get... say anything? Did Rob say anything in like the past couple minutes? Rob said, uh, "My family doesn't have a lot of money. I'm sorry, I cannot be like Papa." It's, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, Rob. See, because because here's why that's okay. That Papa would not care about your money. He, yeah, he doesn't. Papa's broke. He... Papa's broke. He he does not take any of the money or earnings from the pizza. Okay. Yeah, he gives it to he gives it to homeless shelters. Yeah, he, he anything he, he could do. He he only keeps up an act that he's rich, but in reality, he just constantly is giving and giving and giving. And Pete is just taking and taking and taking. <clears throat> <coughs> now, but I swear to God, how many how many things do they get? How many? Counter UAVs are they gonna call in? Who called in white phosphorus? Anyway. Um. Uh, uh, let's get into. Oh, Alar, can we have a final statement on. You witnessed Pete Davidson do a horrific act uh -huh. at one of the parties we went to, the big Hollywood parties we went to. Okay, he did it with Johnny Depp and involved it like something I don't know. Just can you tell us about this? Yeah, so took one of the little black children from the neighborhood, right? <laughs> little little so kids. sad. So sad. Uh -huh. And he just got beat that poor boy, you know? Fucking beat him. I'll be back. Like, to a pulp. Right? I mean I'm not even joking, I saw like chunks all over the floor. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> and Oh like, Jesus Christ. I'm like John John, like, what are you doing? And he's like, you know, man, these people. I thought mean, you mean Pete. He means Pete. He means Pete. You mean Pete? No, no, no. Johnny Depp. Oh, oh Depp yeah. Oh. And like, damn. Oh. I didn't want to talk to Pete because we honestly didn't feel like talking to him. So I was talking to Johnny Depp. I'm like, oh, you fucking did it. He's like, you had to. I'm like, no, you didn't. We're having a chill time. I don't know why you didn't. That. You're killing the mood. And then the little poor black kid, you know, he woke up, you know, he started crying. And Pete just fucking whacked that kid over the head with a fucking fire extinguisher. Damn, that motherfucker echoed. I'm like, holy shit. And that kid, I don't know what happened. All I heard was someone dragging something down like an alleyway. Of course, like the garbage cans of the house. Like, and all I heard was like ruffling with the garbage can. And I'm like, alright, I'm out of here. You know, I'm not doing anything. And then, how, that's, that's a disgusting act of cruelty. How, how nice. sad did it? How sad did it make you? It made me very sad because I didn't do anything. That kid had a whole life ahead of him. Wow. <laughs> and Johnny Depp beat the shit out of him and killed him. And no, no, no. Pete, Pete delivered the finishing blow. And actually, I was there too. But alarm, alarm forgot to mention because he left before he heard this. I was still trying mm -hmm. to have a good time. Here's what I was doing, alright? I was trying to. Alright. You know that actor Daisy Ridley from, like, the new Star Wars girl? Like, the girl playing, like, the Star Wars? Uh huh. Oh, alright. I'm sorry for that. Uh. Yeah, so she was there. I go to all the parties just pretty much exclusively for her or some other girl. And I was trying to get Daisy's number. I was trying to get laid, alright? But I completely quit after this. I like, cause I had a little bit of a chub because me and Daisy were talking. I was like, you're having a great time. And I had a little bit of a chub, right? In my pants. Then. When I heard that happening, she was like, what's going on? And I was like, oh, nothing. Like, she was like, her back was turned to it. I was like, oh, nothing. And I just, like, like made sure she didn't look over there. Because I was going to let this death get in the way of me getting going to Bone Town. But, um, uh, but, 
then uh, we we um uh, like I heard I heard the ruffling and I heard like the bag the garbage bag and I heard what sounded like like Johnny Depp like grunt like he was picking up something and it was just, like and it was like a big slam like a big metallic slam like he was slamming that poor child into the dumpster with like the force of like a giant sledgehammer All right and I was like you know what I'm just gonna ignore it I'm this is too good of an opportunity. I'm not kidding. We're just gonna ignore it. Whatever. And but then <clears throat> um, I heard Pete go back there. And I heard like two the distinct sound of his jaw and hinging. It's like this dislocating bone. It's like that's what it sounds like, right? And I heard that, and then I heard him take out like the kid out of the garbage can and go like, I'm like like plastic crinkling and him swallow the kid whole and I heard like his stomach acid gargling because it was melting the kid and the kid was still alive a little bit so I heard him like moaning and at that point my chub was just gone and I was like you know what I think it's time I leave then I just left so that's that now I got the personal reasons down the Siren Head isn't a personal type person, okay? Siren Head is in it for the the corporation side of it, okay? Now, when Max gets back, we'll start talking about the corporation side of things and why and why and stuff like that. But until then. We're going to take a short break to get our bearings of the situation, but you know what? We should just talk about, um, yeah. A lot. Yes, sir. How you doing? Um, uh, have any other notable stories? Let's see here. What? Let me see here. I'm thinking. Um... Yeah, I was in another Notable, notable Hollywood stories, yeah, like party stories. I was uh, with um, Miley Cyrus, you know. She threw a birthday party for uh, Billy Ray Cyrus, right? Oh. Uh, now, I was there. You know, Pete was there, too. <laughs> and, I don't know, I saw Pete walk into a bedroom, close the door quickly. I heard a lot of screaming. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. Thing? Right? I opened the damn uh, door. Right? There's a little 13-year-old girl. Named wow. Sam. Oh, no. Penis. Sam, her name is Sam Penis. That's the nickname that Pete gave. She, he, the nickname he gave was Sam Penis. Yes. Now, for viewers at home, there's a great kid named Connor. All right, he might be on the podcast someday. Great kid. He's like five, like eight or five, seven, but he's like 190 pounds of muscle. Forced to be reckoned with. We call him Monkey Man because he has ape strength. Great kid. You know, great family is amazing people. But he has this, he has a sister. Let's just put it nicely. Let's just say uh, is desirable to some people. Okay. That's all I'm going to say. And I guess she was there at the party. Anyway, a lot please go on. Right. All right, so, anyway, they're in the bedroom. I'm like, Pete, what are you doing? And he's like, and he's like oh, this is her first time at a party, right? And I just wanted to comfort her, you know? I'm like, okay, but why do it in the bedroom? You know, it looks shady. Like, yeah, you're right. You know, they walk out, and you know? Yeah. Sam Penis turns around. He says, thank you, Allah. You saved my life. Whoa. That's deep. Now, I have another story for you guys. It involves Chris Brown and Miranda Cosgrove. Now, back, back when iCarly, we they celebrated like the like the uh, fifth year anniversary of it being off the air, like a 
of it, of the ending, like the finale. So I was at that party, of course, you know, I got invited, I'm good friends with, uh, with, um, uh, Dan Schneider, okay. But, um, anyway, I was there. Um, Chris Brown was there, too. Now, she just got, he just got done beating the shit out of Rihanna, alright? <clears throat> but he came back. I was like, um, he just at this party at Miranda Cosco. He was like trying to do stuff with her. And she was like, ew, no, get away from me. Right? Um, he was like, nah, get over here. And she was like, no. And she like punched him, right? And like, oh, that's a bad mistake. And what he started to do, he started to, um, grab her and punched her repeatedly in the face and her face went from already round to like circular pancake and each punch he threw that connected it just got like softer and softer so it went from like right to just like because her face was just a mush and then I don't know it's just just awful. It's just awful. Um, and then, I remember, Pete Davidson was there, and he ran. He's like, no. He ran and he tackled Chris Brown, who then returned by beating the shit out of Pete Davidson. Eventually, Chris, Dan intervened. He tasered Chris. And then while he was on the ground, he started sucking on, like, licking and, like, uh, Chris Brown's feet. And then he quickly dragged him to, like, a closet. And I don't know what happened from there, but all I know is that it was just so loud, just screaming, that we just had to move to another room. But Pete was there, and Miranda was like, Thank you, Pete, you saved me. She couldn't talk, right? She was like, Thank you, Pete, you saved me. And then he was like, no problem. Then he grabbed her like her chest, and she's like, "No, I don't. I don't think we should do that." And he's like, "I think you owe me." And then he he squeezed her boobs so hard it exploded, but it not just exploded. It exploded with so much force that my ears were ringing, and there was enough percussion behind it, and it knocked it knocked Miranda Cosgrove out, knocked Miranda straight out, and. Then he grabbed the other boob and squeezed that, and it exploded again. And I just, I, I was, my vision was super blurry at that point because the amount of force, I couldn't even see where I was, like, going. All I can tell you is that I, I just, like, woke up somewhere in, like, a ditch. And Alon was there, too. Mm-hmm. And Vincent was, too. And I was like, whoa, what happened? We're like, Man, do you remember what happened anything last night? And everyone was like, uh, yeah, and then we just talked about it. And then we went, Frank goes to pick us up on this big wave. And then we went back to his place. And then, um, yeah. Just, yeah. Oh, on. Yeah. Don't don't you have a story about how Dan Schneider like like tasered somebody to death? Yeah. So you know, me and Dan Schneider, I was a good friend, you know. I was back to his work and stuff like that. You know, we went out for a drink, you know, downtown in LA. Good bar down there, right? He's a little, of course, there's this little kid. He's a big fan of my car. I don't know how he got in a bar, really. You know, to check for ID and shit. Somehow he got it. Anyway. So, you know, he came up to Dan. You know, Dan wasn't having it today. He was like, alright, kid, just back off, you know? And he wouldn't stop pestering him. So Dan took the taser. 
I'm like, just Dan, that's too much. I'm like, just like yell at the kid or something. He's like, no, I have to do this. He fucking tased the kid. And I was like, all right, he tased him. He falls back, you know, he's done. No, he still tased him in 30 seconds. That led to cardiac arrest. Of course, I was already out of the scene. That's my story about Dan Snyder. He has a horrible temper. <laughs> No, Vincent. Yeah. Didn't. Didn't um. Chris Brown and Frank Ocean get into a fight one time, and that's actually true. That's a. I mean, all of this is true, but they actually in fact got into two fights. Frank got uh, his revenge on Chris Brown. Vincent, you want to tell us about that? Okay, so what happened was uh. So, Frank was just, we were at a Hollywood party, and uh, I'm gonna tell you about the second time that nobody really, I'm gonna tell you about a time that no one really has heard of, it hasn't really gone public yet, this happened pretty recently, like a week ago, people haven't really covered it yet, so we were at a Hollywood party, and Chris Brown walks up to Frank, and is like, and he's like, oh shit, hold on, alright, and he started like, yelling at him, getting up in his face. And so Frank is like, just leave me alone. I'm here with my husband. I just want to have a good time. And so Chris grabs me and is like, you're not going anywhere. And then they start like fighting. And they're like punching each other right in the head. And like both their heads like going back like 90 degrees after each punch. And then Frank grabs him and throws him onto the table with all the food on it. And it spills everywhere, gets everywhere. And then Chris... Gets really pissed, storms off, and then starts beating the shit out of some women in the bathroom. Now, didn't <clears throat> Frank Ocean like beat up? Didn't Frank beat up Chris Brown's daughter? Uh, yes, he did. And see, but I know that sounds bad, folks, but it was justified. It was justified. That's, you know. Here, let's take a break from the official, the official piece right now. I'm still waiting for Max to come back, and then we're going to cover Siren's head. Siren head's whole involvement here. Um... Yes, let's just talk about our normal lives, everyone. Oof. If anybody's in chat, want any, want to ask advice questions or life questions or something like that, we're here. We got you. We got you. Okay. I am <clears throat> Okay Let's just talk about our personal lives again If anybody is recording Now and they want any advice or to talk about anything in life, or we want us to share our opinion on the situation. You know, we can talk. We will get back into. We covered Pete Davidson's involvement, and we're gonna cover Siren Head's involvement when Max gets back. So then, let's just talk. A lot. Yes, sir. Let's use code names here. Um. So. What's your plan to make a move on E or A? Is it A or E? Uh, it's E. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna wait a couple weeks. 
hopefully after Christmas break, you know, Christmas break, you know, I'm gonna look like a total fucking disgusting being. Uh, you know? Just give me yep. a couple weeks to fucking clean up. Really. Yeah. Yeah, you know, you see how the tides are. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, one second, one second. Rob, uh, you are cool, but I has to go, but I will be on later for the stream. All right, Rob, you're still here. Thank you. Uh, love you. We'll see you later tonight again, 8 p.m., around 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I don't know what time zone you're in, but for us it's Eastern Standard, so 8 p.m. All right. Uh, but I don't want to keep talking. Um, you know, just seriously, how the tides change. And yep, is uh, Connor here? I don't think so. Yeah, I think he disappeared. Because you mentioned Sam and he didn't do anything. Yeah, I'm certainly so. like fighting him in detail. All right, it says you guys should also stream Minecraft, and I'll be there. Okay. Yeah, we will. We will stream. We will stream Minecraft. Um, one of these days, probably tomorrow, if we're on. If we're on tomorrow, which we most likely will be. Um, we will stream Minecraft. We'll yeah, we'll stream pretty much whatever you recommend if we have it. But yeah, we will stream Minecraft with all of us together. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, we'll see you at the next stream. Uh, um. Yeah. So, but hold on. What if E doesn't work out? Are you gonna go for M? Most likely not. Most likely not. Why not? Yeah, no, they're really close to each other. If it doesn't work with them, most likely gonna be a thing. If you 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 should pull an Antonio, which is hit on the twins. Like when one doesn't work, hit on the hit on the other one, and then see how it works. And it didn't work out, so. I don't know. I think he made a bad choice. He went for D instead of G the first time around. I'm like, I'm like, D's an NPC. G's not an NPC. Mm -hmm. So, you, you got inside here, that's what I'm like, yeah. bro. But, um... Yeah, uh... But, no, I think, I think, honestly, you should go for, like... M. Our next our next stream is at eight, right? Yeah, it's at eight. Everyone's gonna be around at face Brian. <laughs> Stupid. But yeah, if it's it's around eight or so. And we're not using your thumbnail, we apologize. But oh. we have a lot just has a better a better thumbnail. But, uh, yeah, why are you leaving? Hello? What? Alright, good answer, is it? What? I wasn't paying attention. I asked if you were leaving. Uh, no, I'm not gonna leave. Okay. When's this stream ending? When is this stream ending? I have no clue. I'll probably... I probably have to go around six. So probably then, but if it doesn't end, officially end, it's probably just gonna transform into the Mr. P stream. We have to wait for Max to still come back where the, he is. Well, you may text him. If I can. Yeah, yeah text that loser cut back here. <clears throat> Anybody want to do Doomsday Heist in GTA? Um, are we going to have to go through that painful thing again? Yep. Let's wait for Max first. You may put it on normal or easy so it's like actually possible. Yeah, but we gotta wait for Max.
me versus Lil Huddy. I think I'd be able to literally massacre. Right, Mass well, it wouldn't guys, even be a fight. It's at it's at eight, right? It's at eight. All right, uh, I'm gonna go. Be back okay. on eight. Okay. Bye. Bye. Let's go back to this little honey famous TikTok creator uh, is banging Charlie D'Amelio. Would I be able to beat them in a fist fight? Along what would you say? Mm -hmm. Uh, hang on. What's that? Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a pleasure. I'll be back around eight. Oh, I for real? Food. Yes, for real. Oh my lord. So, all right. Uh, uh, peace, peace, bro. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, just me right now. Holy shit, I just realized what was happening there. Alright, um, now, I was gonna talk, since it's just me, let's talk. Person who just joined the chat, I think someone just joined the chat, um, we are talking about how Papa John's was set up by Steve, but Pete Davidson and Siren Head. But since everybody left, we're gonna have to wait on the siren has part. We already covered Steve's part. Give it a run to oh fuck. He's gone. Alright, well Oh well. Um, let's just talk about Would I be able to beat up little Huddy? Alright. That's the question. And I have the answer. 100% wouldn't even be a fight, it'd be a massacre. I, I do boxing, alright. I'm like, imagine white Mike Tyson. I hit very hard. Hello? Pretty fast. I got good skill, everything, everything's there. Are I you still talking to the stupid stream? Alright. I'll... Just wait for it. I'll, I'll be I'll, I'll, I'll be white, like Tyson. They call me white, Mike Tyson. White. White Tyson. They call me White Tyson. Hello. Shut up, Max. Who are you talking to? Anybody who. Listening. There's nobody listening. <laughs> Actually, I think there's one. Rob is still listening. He said, "Let's see." Wait, Rob still here? I think I love that conversation. You. All no, are no, cool, no, but I has to go. Yeah, I'll be yeah, later yeah, for the other you. stream. You guys should also stream Minecraft, and I'll be there. I, I, I told him, yeah, we're gonna stream Minecraft like probably tomorrow. Vincent said, end. "Where are you at?" Who said that? Vincent, where is Did everyone? No, uh, he messaged me like three minutes ago. Gone. They left like within five minutes. How they all get off? Hello? Hello, Zach? Connor just texted me an interesting message, which I don't know why he messaged that. What is it? I'm not gonna say it, Shira. Say it. I can't. Why? Oh, my neck. Oh, my God. Oh, my collarbone like, hurts so bad. Say it right now. Max, I swear to God, if you keep going on about this, I will crash my car right into your house. Say it. It's covered. Vincent said he'll be back at 8. Yes. No, no. We, are, we already solved that. Oh. Everything. What did Connor say? Um, I can't. I'll tell you later. Tell me right now. Nobody's I even can't. watching the stream. Yeah, but this stream will be up later for... Fine, I'll mute the stream. 
I don't know how to do that. Say it. Okay, what? You impatient bastard. Say it right now. Why can't you just, like, wait? Say it right now. Oh, fuck, I'll fucking text you. Oh, Rob boy. is back, by the way. Rob is back. What's up, Rob? Rob, we need more people. <laughs> Good car, right? <laughs> what did Connor say, Zach? I'll take a text for you. Wait, is Rob back? Rob is back. Oh, 100% he's back. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Everybody. <laughs> Okay, I'll be back again. I was just checking to see if everyone was here still. Oh my lord. Pull up the stream and talk to Rob. I... Read him. I'm fine. I know you're gone, Max. Everyone on back, I'm sorry. Sorry for what? No, I'm be sorry about... Nothing to be sorry about. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I right, just over hose right now. That's it. I'm just not. These bitches ain't shit. Bitches ain't shit. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry, you guys. Half the guys have. Don't have, uh, I have not a lot of viewers. Listen, you know, it sucks, but at the end of the day, what could you do? If you want to help, I guess you could just somehow spread the word of our stream. Maybe to your friends or just online or something if you want. But, you know, no, you know, they just, just exist. Have any questions or you guys want advice on something or just anything, you know? Just, just I'm here. Right, right, we'll, we'll start covering why Siren Head is in on this soon. But until then, we're just chillaxed. Why are you guys so passionate? <laughs> <coughs> I have a very good answer for you, Rob. And the answer is, I don't know. There you go. Zip. Who knows? I will say this, though. Even though I'd be able to beat the shit out of little Huddy, because I'm like a white Mike Tyson. Okay? I mean, massacre him. Even at the end of the day, if I did that, he still wins. Cause at the end of the day, he's he's plowing a hot chicken. I'm not. There you go. That's my view on the situation. That's my view on the situation. How big are you? I am five foot ten. This morning I'm at two twenty two. But I'm going to be dropping in weight a little... Actually, I don't want to drop in weight. I don't want, I don't want to drop in weight. I want to be a heavyweight. Remain a heavyweight. I box. I want to remain a heavyweight, but I'm probably going to have to drop down in weight. Because my dad is 6'2". And in his prime, he was only like 180, 190 to 200. So, I don't know. I think probably when all of a sudden it's done, I'm going to go to 175, see how I feel there. And then, yeah, I'll start lifting a weight soon because I don't lift weights at all, so we'll just see how that works out. But, again, answer your question. 5'10", like 222, max is like 6 foot and a half, 6 foot 1 maybe, like 200 pounds. 
Alon is like 5'11 and like 140. Vincent's like 6'1 and like something. I'm 6 feet 5 inches and weigh 210 pounds. Damn, so I'm 6 foot 5. You should probably. You should lift the weights and shit. Why not? Coming to Animal. You got the height in there. Might as well get the mass, you know? Just be able to kill anybody in your path. Why not? <coughs> I do. Good. Keep doing it. Ah. Good, good, good. My goal is right now in life is to get through. I'm I have a little fat, but I have little fat, but lots of definition. Well, I got a friend of mine. He will never be on the stream. Maybe, possibly, who knows? But he um he lifts a lot of weights, and his whole deal is like aesthetics. But like I'm just for. Performance, he is aesthetics, but yeah, he's going through a lot of like, what do you call it? I don't know, his weight and diet stuff right now. I get more definition and shit. I can lift both my parents above my head. You know, that's a good thing. I can't say the same. I can lift my mom above my head most likely. She's only like 5'5 five, five and like 120 pounds. But my dad, it's like six two two fifty or more. So I definitely could not lift them above my head. I used to do wrestling. My whole shtick was I could pick up anybody, any weight class. But I sucked at it, so it don't even matter. It do not matter. No, no, no. I had to carry our donkey to the vet, and I had to, and I had it over my shoulder. Well, you sound like a good man. Um, I think you should start making the donkey start lifting weight. Um, maybe see how that goes. I, I kind of want, I, I don't want a donkey per se. I would like a donkey. I'd take a donkey. But a big deal would be um goat. I got like spiritual connections with goats. Yo! <laughs> One sec, guys. I was talking to Rob. But my dad thinks I'd be really good at just weightlifting and stuff. Because the other day in boxing, I got the shit beat out of me. Like, so, I don't know, we were just talking, was like, maybe boxing is a new thing, maybe it's this or that. But he still wants me to stick with it. I really want to stick with it. I really just don't want to do it. So we're going to still do it. We're going to try harder. We're going to get better. Alright. And I'm just going to... I hit hard. I got lead hands and arms, so I think... I'm just gonna get the veracity, speed, and everything down. Then I'm just gonna start just slaughtering people. That's my whole goal. That's the goal. Yep, yep, yep. She's a big girl, weighs around 650. <laughs> Tell Max on my chest, alright Rob. So here's here's what Rob says. He asked he said, I'm sorry you guys don't have a lot of viewers. I said it's alright, if you wanna help out you can like just spread the word somehow, tell your friends or just like other people or on social media. Then he said, Why are you guys so passionate? And I said, I don't know. 
and then I said I'd be able to destroy Little Huddy. It'd be <laughs> a fight, it'd be a massacre. So I'm like, White Mike Tyson. And he asked how big you are. I told him how big I am and you are. He said, I'm six foot five and weigh 210 pounds. And he says, he lifts weights and he has a lot, he has a bit of fat on him, but he has a lot of definition. Wow. And then he said he had to, he could lift both of his parents above his head. What the heck? <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> then he said, I had to carry the donkey to the vet and I picked it up over my shoulder. They said she's a big girl, weighs around 650 pounds. Whoa. Rob is a, the guy we want. Rob uh, is the guy we want. On our army. So is Lau. Lau is a... Lau is a Lau's good... A, he's a great man. Join me, Zachary. You gotta hit the point, man. I did. I did. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna do the pressure on Anthony Joshua. I'm just gonna, I'll take this loss and I'll just make myself better, better in myself, and come back better and stronger. Do who would win in a fight, Anthony Joshua or this person? I'll tell you who. Most likely Anthony Joshua. But I don't know. It depends on who you're talking about, I guess. Come on, bud. It's okay. You can join. <laughs> This player, this player does not have gay. Uh, it says players are sufficiently gay for you to join. Okay, I believe it. Now let's get back into the swing. Oh, what's happening? So siren head. Okay. Yep. He's uh, he's not in it for the personal reasons. Like he, he's in it for the corporation reasons. Corporate reasons, okay. Yeah, Sarnhead, he's trying to make money. Sarnhead is not just trying to make money; he's trying to take down other people in his path. Okay. He he is just a dangerous just creature. Okay. And his whole goal is to like own businesses and then just wreck them. And what is he doing with Papa John's Pizza right now? The same exact thing. He is taking the better ingredients and better pizza and making it worse ingredients and worse pizza. Okay. Why is he doing this? Because he's evil. He literally is a 20 foot tall siren head monster thing. Okay. He only works for the money aspects of things. And he, like Vat19, he works with Vat19.com. Now, Vat19.com wants to be the only people to sell food. <coughs> so this goes back into yesterday's stream, which you might want to watch that, get the lowdown, but the, um, but yeah, Vat19 wants to be the only people selling food. Who sells food? No, 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 little old people called Papa John's Pizza. Alright. Nice, you wanna talk about Siren Head? Siren Head? Uh, I have no clue who Siren Head is. The big Siren Head creature. Oh, uh, the creature. Okay, so Siren Head. He works with... Okay, he works with Pete Davidson, okay? Pete Davidson of Vat19.com. Yeah, so they met one day by chance, okay? And they found out they both had a mutual hate for Papa John's. For different they, reasons. Different reasons, but they still wanted to take it down yeah. by yeah. the end. So Siren Head, he's just like... He's just a businessman, right? But he's yeah. corrupt. Super corrupt. Mm -hmm. And him and Pete's plan is they already went through with it. Okay? They ruined Papa John's career. And we're just trying to expose the truth and help Papa yeah. John's. Now, we would love to have a sponsor with Papa John's. Let's try to clear the truth here. If this video could get to him, that'd be great. Cause we're just trying to clear his name up. 
Now, what did he say the N word? There's no he denying did. that he said the N word. But what was the context behind us saying that? Max, get over here to me. The stream needs to see this. It's important. I'm coming. Make sure you have a scope. On a scope? Your on your gun. I don't have a scope. I have a scope now. <sighs> it sucks to me. It's it text to me an image. It's probably like a dick pic. <laughs> yeah. He's probably trying to get Okay, Kirk I'm here. Boo, it's in low blow. I'm here. Anyway, zoom in on like these oranges and lines. Wait, there's a kid. Whoa. They're hungry. Max, quickly, look at the oranges and lines. I'm it's going. Like, like, zoom in on it. It's so scary. But they're beautiful. Well, like they are. Day. They spend so much time on the oranges. Oh my! <laughs> what an animal! What an animorph! What an animorph! Oh yeah, Tomorrow. soon we'll be talking about animorphs, okay? And the connection it has with somebody. We don't want to reveal too much now. But yeah. <coughs> Check the chat. Has Rob said anything? Mm, not yet. No new news. See. You see, you see. Damn, 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 that's crazy. <coughs> Do we still have you have anyone in the stream? If you are in the stream, please speak now. I don't know, it says one. And that would be me. Uh oh, Rob, where did Rob go? I don't know. Oh, you're a nerd. Cause I have to ask Rob a question. Yeah, did you see what Sydney posted? Sydney, I have been seen what Sydney posted. <laughs> He looks good in it. Let's see. Let's see what Sydney has posted. Which one? What do you mean? Which one? I don't know, the one where she's like, I haven't posted in a minute. Oh, this one? Sydney! She's still not, she's still not the best. Yes, she is. No. Yeah, she is. Bob, where are you? We need you to have TikTok. In Rob? Rob, Rob, Bob. I feel Almost. like Rob won't have it. Yeah, but we'll see. I didn't know it was seemingly like possible to not have it. I know. Like, well, I'll say he did. I was like, huh? Like he just didn't have it. Chill. Chill, bro, bro. Chill, bro. I'm just trying to get Chill. a kill streak. Chill, bro, bro. 
Oh, he got me! <gasps> Is my audio still on? Nope. What? I was checking my audio was still on. And it's not. <coughs> like, they the first stream could hear us? No, like, I could he make it echo. Said, come, come feed her. Come here. He wants me to feed my dogs. So you know what that means. That means you will indeed feed the dogs. I'm gonna feed the dogs, so I'll probably be back in like ten minutes, cause then I have to like take them outside and shit. Wow. I, oh, I'll this man. Me. This man gets me. That is cray cray. Alright, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll be back. Okay. Oh, the same guy, not close. And we have no viewers. Uh, we have no viewers. Dang it!
Millennium's deathmatch.
deathmatch. Enemy incoming. Weapons ready. Go, you Hello? Anything happened? No. We have no Wait. new people we're in. Did Rob say anything? No, he left. It's nobody now. Did he say he was leaving or no? Remember he said before he... Actually, I don't know. He just said, tell Max all our chats, and then he disappeared. Yeah. That's so sad. I know. <laughs> Robbie is gone. Can you send out messages? What do you mean? Can you send out messages? Through what? Um. Bro, I'm so confused. What are you saying right now? Um, can you like, like be like, stream is? Oh, I don't think so. You can you make a short video on your phone just screaming, stream will be at eight. <laughs> yeah. Just do the. Okay. Send it to me first. I'll I'll tell you if it's good or not. <laughs> oh my god. Max. Yep. What's up? I don't know. I'm just gaming. I'm just gaming, yo. Know. Oh my god, oh my this god. man. What? Oh my god, I'm parkour. There's new parkour trials. There is? Call of Duty World War 2 has Hollandar parkour skills. <sighs> I know. It actually has. No. No! It was literally right there. I was 0.6 <laughs> seconds off. Retry. I don't know where I slipped up. Damn. I don't know where I slipped up, but... Alex already invited me to a game. Don't join him. Yes. Yeah. I can't eat that my kind. I am in a game.
No! Every time I try and execute someone. Three stars. Three stars. Three stars. Three stars, you said? I could yep. be in that. I could get it first time. I have 42.8 seconds. 42.8? I remember that. Those eyes made my penis try to fall asleep. Oh my. Oh Max, my. Is your dear eyes showing your pee pee fall asleep? Yeah, they're just like. When my eyes close, my pee pee closes. Why? I don't know. Is it, they're like connected. It's so crazy cool. Do it. Oh, you bum. You're a bum. You're a head bum, bum, head bum. That's stupid. Okay, let's try the thing real quick. Let's tell Alex though before so he doesn't get off. RQ, 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 RQ. RQ. Risky parkour, which one? Uh, knife, right? Knife. Okay. The one on like that, that map of the trains. Okay. <laughs> Why can't I do it? Oh, because it's starting. I just wasted. Is that real? Yeah. I think I just used 11 tickets because I kept spamming it. <laughs> <laughs> no yeah, because it went down. The number went down. This course is about to be. Without touching the ground. Touching the ground. Where am I supposed to be going? Am I going through here? I don't know where to go. I got lost. Oh, I have to go in here. I got a tactical boost. Oh, I lost. I lost. Oh my god. That's what that's like. You got one? I don't believe you. I did. Whoa. How? In what? Wait. Don't you want me to, you want me to take a screenshot? In what, though? Take a, a screenshot. Game. Yeah. Take a screenshot. <laughs> I dare you. No, but for real though, that was horrific. That's how many people you actually have to kill. Yeah. I felt like I killed a million. I felt like I literally killed a million people. Like, I don't, I don't believe else. this. No, 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 no. I did it for a trial. Like, there's oh, like, a trial. You see, that you see that juggernaut trial? Yeah. It gives you a tactical move, but like. I have to keep count of how many people I killed. There's no <laughs> way that was third. That had to have been over there. 
No, I messed right, up. Oh, right oh wait, never mind. We, we got it. I got 40 seconds. 40 oh, seconds. Mm -hmm. On the dot. On the dot. You get the reward. Do you, does the tactical do count if you have, like, the juggernaut equipped and you get it? It depends if you have the, uh... I think you have to have a special thing on. You what know, you? you know the, uh, the perk? The perk that lets you turn kill streaks into score streaks. That's when it counts? I think. It might not, though. It might not, though. Come on, Zachary. Come on, bud. You're playing with Alex RD. Should I end the stream? Yeah. We can't stream all the way into the Mr. Beast stream. <laughs>